peace happy now now is the vibrate not too far in the future not too far in the past oh, the wall right there i can't not too far in the past right now right now matter of fact still Stand up, brainstorming, making sure I get these videos done. I ain't gonna say brainstorming because most of this is not even coming to me without, most of this is coming to me without even having to try to think. Because, matter of fact, my, my left brain logic, I've been trying to use it as less and less as possible, you know, because that really tie you to the ego. But uh, thinking about like old souls and, well, I thought about how old souls and DMT trips like a how a DMT trip, one of my experiences kind of go into the experience of being an old soul. And what I mean by like, you know, old old souls, you know what I'm saying? Remember being a drop of water or a grain of sand or like, you know, a one electron in the element, you know what I'm saying? Like an old soul has memories of, of these things, you know what I'm saying? Because a lot of reasons why as old souls, we cooperate with people, you know, so well. We have a better understanding of the universe because we done had to be that that element that that depends on everything. You know what I'm saying? Like we done been in those in those type of forms that that allow you to see the oneness of the universe. You know what I'm saying? Well, as a tree, you know what I'm saying? You see the oneness of the universe because you see that even though you wasn't physically moving, that so it's provided you with everything you needed like you know what i'm saying like all those type of incarnations is basically lessons you know what i'm saying but that old soul you know basically that experience you know what i'm saying is one of the things too like with on dmt trips i know one of my dmt trips from matter of fact from feeling like being the primordial energy of source like from i'm talking about that it, it, which is no day one in essence, you know what I'm saying? But to put it in your human perspective mind, like that day one energy, you know what I'm saying? That primordial Cyclops, fucking uh, <laughs> Medusa, you know what I'm saying? That Kundalini, Pioneer, that primordial, like that darkness, that raw, just true energy away from, you know, man, you know what I'm saying? But I, I felt that, I felt like I was like like I said, like a electron, like one electron and one element, you know what I'm saying? I felt that. I felt what it felt like to be a a, a molecule separating in me in a, what it is, meiosis and my toe, you know what I'm saying? All these different little forms, you know what I'm saying? Like I felt what it was like to be an actual just a mitochondria, you know what I'm saying? Like I've you know, in all essence, like every type of life form or anything you could think of, you know what I'm saying? And that's why we old souls, because, you know, we've been here longer than these newer souls that don't have these understandings. As a matter of fact, and we're old souls too, because not only we've been on earth for the longest or whatever, but we're also past her, you know, we're not even from here, you know what I'm saying? We've been existing on our own, you know, in our own solar system, you know, in our own star systems away from here, you know, eons and eons before we even came to earth, you know what I'm saying? That's why as an old soul we have these concepts of understanding how love and the universe work. Like an old soul, like compared to like say fences where just real in this other situation where like, you know, with the regaining of culture where the indigenous melanated people is getting back, you know, the culture and understanding. But an old soul old soul understands that yes, this is part of the order of spirituality, but you're not creating separation um, while you're doing that, you know what I'm saying? You're creating the oneness of making everybody understand that this is all, you know, that I, I all, you know, it's all our heritage, you know what I'm saying? But an old soul not trying to separate and say, well, look at this black person over here, look at this white person over here, look at this Indian, look at this Chinese. You know, old soul understands that, man, it's a big ass universe out there. And so big that that's why, you know, you wonder why, like, you may not be allowed to get out there like that because if you cannot and I always bring this up but if you cannot get over being a different skin pigmentation 
then you can't go out into the cosmos and or go out to other astral planes. You know what I'm saying? You can't be allowed on astral planes with that type of mind frame. You know what I'm saying? Like still thinking like, oh, that person gay limit. You know what I'm saying? Of course they have the agenda of the situation with the government, but nah, you know what I'm saying? You don't knock nobody as understanding the love and all old souls understand that. And that's why we resonate with each other. You know, that's why old soul. If you see. Old souls will be somebody where you might see me, you know, with my roster hat. You might see a brethren with a Confederate flag on, you know what I'm saying? With Dixieland, you know what I'm saying, on a, on a thing. But, you know, we'll, if we practice, if that person's an old soul like me, in which, in cases you'll see it happen, well, you'll connect regardless of our outer shell. Because we understand that this is an outer shell that just comes from the understanding of the family that we chose to be in in this lifetime, you know what I'm saying? And this is not our true self, so we have a understanding of being able to talk regardless of what our upbringing was, you know, in this, you know, in this lifetime, you know what I'm saying? And old souls have that understanding, you know what I'm saying? It's basically, as a matter of fact, breaking down that, uh, like, uh, the old souls, you know what I'm saying, have that, how do you say, that they transcend the ego, you know, that ego transit, transcendence, because, matter of fact, old souls have been through the, through the process of life review, you know what I'm saying, many times where you relive your ego, and that's the thing, seeing what, how your ego harmed, and how it attached itself to things, you know what I'm saying, and that's, and it say, what, what people feel to realize, man, you have this chance in this lifetime, right, you have a chance in this physical form before you even go to the astral plane to correct that right now. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know, that's why, you know, it's, it's biblical time. You have to, you know, have that chance right now. But the old souls, like I said, just uh, understand the being here. So that's why old souls break, you know, have that break down the ego much better, that, that break down the ego and that love, so you, you'll find old souls tend not to dwell on separating, with, even with culture. I mean, I, like, I'm understand Rastafari, Haile Selassie, you know, dealing with the Kushites and stuff like that, you know, and knowing that, yes, this is some of the oldest, you know, beings on earth, but you gotta understand that, man. There is bigger things than just one continent on earth. You know what I'm saying? There are bigger things than one culture, you know, on earth. You know what I'm saying? And yes, that is important. I'm not taking away the importance from it, especially for my egotistical cut. <laughs> Don't trip. You know, that's your ego tripping. <laughs> you know, pun intended. You know what I'm saying? But... You got to get away from, you know, you got to transcend that ego. And that's what the old soul understand is that, you know, we're all one organism and we all make mistakes and, you know, we all fall victim to being a, to being judgmental. We all fall victim to hate. We all, you know, is a chance that that can happen to all of us. And old souls understand that because we done been reincarnating and saw it. We done, we done been a murderer before. We done been probably a, a, a homosexual before. And just saying in the essence of like going through these different things, like I say, to learn lessons, you know what I'm saying? To put you in a position of empathy to understand other people and other organisms' plight. You know what I'm saying? That's where it goes back to actually being a, a, a drop of water and this and that so you can understand the, the cohesiveness of oneness in the universe. Without one, you can't have the other. Invite, you know, you start to really get that universal understanding. That's what uh, what DMT and psychedelics really do for you. That's why, why to be honest with you, why the black community, the conscious black community kind of be missing that, you know, that, that oneness aspect, you know, why they just roofing off the, you know, and like I say, it's all good to collect and get our heritage and our culture back because, matter of fact, the indigenous culture and heritage is the, the heritage and culture of the earth, of all earthlings, no matter. So that goes for anybody, you know what I'm saying, everybody. But it's like that's a, you know, that's something on a small level to be reaching for, you know what I'm saying, as far as like, it, it's just bigger stuff. It's more to the existence than just, you know, those cultural little things, you know, situations going on. Like I say, breaking down the left uh, logic ego. And two, and thinking about of uh, like dealing with the DMT trip of breaking down the ego and the old soul understanding. But like on DMT trips and stuff like that, you break down and you transcend the ego and kill the ego on a level where 
you become conscious. Let's see, you become conscious of how can I say of God of being source. You know what I'm saying, and you become that that source consciousness, that source awareness without the attachment to identification, you know what I'm saying? Because that's what your ego is. Your ego is trying to identify itself. Your ego is saying, no, wait, I can't, I don't want to just be, I got to be something, identify me. You know, call me a Rasta, call me this. You know, say I have brown skin, you know what I'm saying? Like, that's the ego, you know what I'm saying? When source understand that it's one, you know, and that's a matter of fact, when you're tripping on, or when you, you know, on DMT, that 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 feeling that may feel like something trying to kill, which is not trying to kill you, is your ego feeling that like or this nervousness. That's because your ego is feeling scared of debt. You know what I'm saying? Knowing that is about to get his ass broke down, and you about to get a spiritual lesson and understanding that everything is one. You know what I'm saying? So that ego get nervous, but like, well, this motherfucker about to find out I'm a hoax. You know what I'm saying? Basically, what 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 be happening? You know what I'm saying? But when you're on DMT trips and, or, or, you know, mushrooms, you know, dealing with the psilocybin, because me, I know I did four ACO DMT is more of a psilocybin base. In matter of fact, it was done orally. You know, most most uh, DMT, you know, uh, chemical, well, whether you call it chemicals, however you want to, you know, associate with the powders or whatever, it, it uh, most of them don't dissolve, you know, or are, are, are not made to be taken orally because most of them will get... Uh, eaten up by the stomach acid, but particularly particularly this 4-ACO DMT, you know what I'm saying, I took orally and it, you know, did the job and matter of fact was in there for, you know, it keeps you connected for a long time, but you basically get to these points of like you breaking down your ego and matter of fact you'll find yourself fighting for that attachment and when you got that spiritual understanding though, you'll know to like, alright, let go, don't fight this feeling, you know what I'm saying. But like you really become like just awareness where you just being, you know what I'm saying? Like no thoughts, no nothing. You just soaking in and downloading all the information. But you be just become a point of awareness. Kind of like being in the now, you know what I'm saying? Not focusing on time, you know, not focusing on egotistical bills or trying to build your identity. You're just being, you know what I'm saying? Which is the universe. It just is being. It's not trying to say, hey, I'm God. You know, God ain't asking for identification. That's our egos trying to identify God, in essence. You know what I'm saying? When you break it down on that level, you know what I'm saying? But it it is an old soul thing of just, you know, realizing and understanding that you've been here and then being a part of, you know, those primordial materials, you know what I'm saying? DMT will help, help you get that connection, you know, where you get that, that feeling of, that prime all your awareness, you know what I'm saying? Like, before it was the word, before it was light, man, you know what I'm saying? Like, eternity, eternal, man, you know, and get that understanding. But that that's where it comes from, and I, I you know, in which I don't even want to get on the subject, but, you know, it, it, it is, is a thing, too, where... It is already in you, you know what I'm saying? Like, if you feel like you gotta like, oh yeah, yeah, I feel like that too. Or uh, on a tag alone, nah, I mean it, in which everything speaks for itself on the spiritual path, but you know, so everything uh, point out itself, but you know, but it's detrimental to your growth when, cause say friends, I watch people all the time where, you know, I bring up information like, and, and there ain't nothing wrong with that in essence because you're getting excited about getting close to your spirituality, but it's like some people may feel like, oh, yeah, I did that. Oh, yeah, I think I, I, like, you know, trying to be a part of the experience without really knowing for sure. Like, old souls, you know, and indigos, we know what we are, you know what I'm saying? Been knowing what we are, you know what I'm saying? That's why when we connect, we never want to stop talking to each other, you know what I'm saying? Because it's like, Ah, like damn, I never get to, you know what I'm saying, open up and run it on this level because, you know, most of the other people in this existence is not old souls like most of us. Yeah. But yep, yeah, old souls, you know, just a few little overviews have an overstanding of life's deeper lessons, you know what I'm saying? In touch with natural metaphysical gifts, so you know, most of us old souls 
kind of like been knowing like man we we got psychic ability you know been having that hunch about knowing that you got these abilities by using your third eye and your chakras all this you know you've been you know knowing this you know uh more more spiritually aware you know what i'm saying so again you know being aware and knowing that you got these spiritual abilities you know importance of forgiveness and importance mm -hmm. of love you know what i'm saying old souls like i brought up like well old soul the been a robber a, a lawyer a judge a murderer a woman man you know what i'm saying you know been all kind of things to where you develop an empathy for all forms of life so you have an understanding you want to see somebody who's not an old soul somebody who never naturally understands why somebody could do something. If somebody, if a person, matter of fact, you want to count out a fraud, if somebody call themselves an old soul, but then be like always like, man, I can't see how so-and-so do this. Man, I can't see how people, I can't see is like, ah, well, you obviously haven't been reincarnating along with the rest of us old souls because we definitely understand how a human being could be dysfunctional. You know what I'm saying? Like, how could you not, see how uh, another serial killer could pop up when we got like 30 of them on record, you know what I'm saying? That's just in this lifetime. You know what I'm saying? Like, so how could, you know, these things be so, uh, like, surprising, you know? That's the thing, old soul's not surprised by any of these things because there's nothing new under the sun. You know what I'm saying? Matter of fact, most of us old souls and Matter of fact, in star seeds in general, you know, we come back with this understanding of knowing that history is going to repeat itself unless we come through with this love. You know, like a lot of people egotistically, like I say, getting attached to these skin pigmentations and and culture, which culture this, which culture, you know what I'm saying? Like I say, it's important to understand the 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 indigenous culture of earth, you know, dealing with the melanated people, but don't but don't dwell in it and 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 and, and separate yourself with it. You know what I'm saying? Because that's another thing. Some people, some of these conscious people, who you know what I'm saying, they lack love. You know what I'm saying? That's one thing I've been. I don't care what nobody conscious. I don't care how much books you read or whatever. You know what I'm saying? It's about love at the end of the day. You know what I'm saying? So you could go around preaching hate. On both sides of the fence, have no like I say, no matter what skin pigmentation you are, on the on the lighter side, darker side, no matter what your culture is, if you're not being righteous, you're not being righteous. Point blank, period. You know what I'm saying? And that's what I be trying to get a lot of like people to understand, like you know, like righteousness is righteousness. You know what I'm saying? You don't go like, oh yeah, with well, this, you know, like say fences with the racism in America. You know, yeah, it. it America was built on racism, this and that, but that don't mean you go around shushuing about, like, all white people, you know what I'm saying? Because, matter of fact, because some of them are black, too. If you got that deep understanding, you wouldn't even be walking around shushuing like that, too. That's another thing, you know what I'm saying? And I, I want to put that on blast because I think a lot of, you know, brethren kind of, not say get away with, but in essence, you know, like, you calling yourself, like, you know, a conscious leader, a conscious this, and that's what... The end of goals, like, that's why I see what we are really here for, for the love aspect, because yeah, I still see that a lot of people think that consciousness is reading the meta nature 30 times or, you know, learning about meditation, you know what I'm saying? That's not, you know, that, that adds to it, but the true consciousness is understanding the oneness of the universe and the divineness uh, of unconditional love, and I say that, you know, but understanding that everything is built off of unconditional love and getting back to that intelligence of that, you know what I'm saying? That's why you got these little star seed children that, like I had a little star seed ask me like, man, what, like straight up, like why black people and white people can't get along, you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm like, bro, you know, it's cause of certain mind frames that have been instilled. And that's the thing too, I talk to youngsters like with the realness, you know what I'm saying? And that's another thing, old souls understanding that Star sees, even though they physically may be looking younger than you, they just as old, you know, we old together, you know, and that's a job as an indigo to teach the little star, the next star seeds in line, you know what I'm saying, on what's going on, look, here's the game plan, you know what I'm saying, point blank period, you know, like, here's what's been going on, you know, here's what we need to do to change the situation, you know, and that's why the indigos, we came out a little rough, 
You know what I'm saying? Like some blockers, you know, to lead the way, you know what I'm saying? For the for the younger light workers, for the younger star seeds to work, you know what I'm saying? And, and spread their love, because I'm starting to see that, you know, the newer star seeds care less and less about that culture situation, you know? Like I say, it's all good to get our indigenous culture back, because it is every earthling's culture in essence, but, you know what I'm saying? Like these new, these new star seeds, these new children, like, man, you know, like on some real, it don't matter if you're black or white type of shit, you know what I'm saying? And matter of fact, on some shit, almost like making, like almost to me, when I look at some, I'm like, bro, it should be embarrassing to some of the elders on how much godly, just straight up loving, you know, loving godly intelligence that some of these star seeds, these kids are being born with. You know, some, some of them, matter of fact, I'd be wanting to boot on my growth, you know what I'm saying? Well, trying to stick close to culture cut and like I say no yes you know what's going on right now we do need our indigenous indigenous earth culture back and we need for all humans to embrace it you know what I'm saying no matter what skin pigmentation and culture you think that you are separately a part of you know what I'm saying you are you know what I'm saying whether you think you European, whether you think you're Mexican, whether you think you're Chinese, whether you think you're whatever, we all got one common place, you know what I'm saying? And you need to stop hiding that common place and that indigenous information on your side, because that's the thing too. Like, that's why it's needed, because on the other end, somebody is still playing, you know, hide and still playing, keep the information away, you know what I'm saying? And that's not cool, you know what I'm saying? It's about being authentic. And that's for everybody. It ain't just for a certain few. Everybody got to be authentic, you know what I'm saying? But I think I done went to authenticity from being one with source also, but it all resonates together, you know what I'm saying? But like matter of fact, where I started with being, having memories of being, like I say, like a, a raindrop or a molecule, like, you know what I'm saying? Like having memories of being a, just a vibration off a DNA strand, you know what I'm saying? Like. It gets that deep, and that's the understanding that, like I say, like the 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 uh, the black culture, the inner city. You know what I'm saying? Where like, oh man, that's white people shit. Oh that yeah. man, look, and I, and that's the realness of the situation, cause that's just what how it gets said and how it happened. Like, oh man, uh, I'm scared. And then, but and two, you gotta be open minded. That's how I looked at the situation. I'm open minded. I ain't no white person shit. Ain't no black person shit. Ain't no Chinese person. It's like what works. You know what I'm saying? Like that that that's what you you wanna really get on a spiritual growth and really, you know, soak in stuff and, and, and really grow is about not discriminating with your knowledge, you know what I'm saying? Like that's the thing, you know what I'm saying? You gotta get it from everywhere and have that understanding on that type of level. You know, so all them oh man, oh mushrooms, oh man, DMT. Like, understand that why you at where you at and you understand like well damn how Kari understand and know about the universe and you know because I wasn't scared to to kill that ego because I wasn't scared to put a knife to the ego like pew, 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 phone check ego but it's with love though because <laughs> that's the you know that's like Kali the build and destroy you know what I'm saying you gotta destroy gotta destroy the ego you gotta phone check the ego in order for the beautiful soul to to be born and reawakened, you know what I'm saying? You gotta, something gotta die, you know what I'm saying? In order to have a, a birth. You know, that's the whole situation. That's why death is the illusion. But, <laughs> peace. I'm gonna stop right there, man. <laughs> Happy now. Now's the vibrate. Not too far in the future. Not too far, oh, small, not too far in the past. <laughs> right now. Now is the vibe rate. Peace. Uh... <laughs>